So we want to solve this quadratic equation by completing the square. I know that we can solve it by um, using the quadratic formula. We can solve it using the solver on our calculators. Uh, we know we're going to get two solutions here, but let's solve it using uh, the method of completing the square. In order to complete the square, what we want to do is make sure that we have a perfect square. So we're going to take a look at the first two terms, and we'll have x squared plus 7x. And we'll take this over to the other side and get, it, get rid of it. And that, we'll do that by adding. So we'll have is equal to 8. And now we want to have a perfect square on the left side of the equation. And in order to have a perfect square on the left side of the equation, what we need to do is to make sure that we can add uh, one half of the value of the b coefficient. That would be one half of 7. And one half of 7 is 7 halves, but we want to square this. So we want to square all of that. 7 halves squared is... Um, 49 quarters. And so we're going to add 49 quarters to both sides of the equation. So we'll end up with x squared plus 7x plus the 49 quarters is equal to, and on the right side of the equation we'll have 8 plus the 49 quarters. So we, we've maintained equality. We've added the same thing to both sides of the equation. We haven't changed it. And so now what we have on the left side is a perfect square. And when we have a perfect square, what that means is that we can factor it. And factoring it, we will result in x plus 7 halves squared is equal to, x plus 7 halves squared will result in the trinomial immediately above, and 8, whoops, we made a mistake here in the, um, made a mis slight mistake in the uh, 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 right-hand side of the equation, 8 plus 49, that should be 8 plus 49 over 4. And 8 plus 49 over 4 is the same as 32 over 4 plus 49 over 4, and that results in x plus 7 halves squared is equal to 81 quarters. So, carrying on from here. We now want to solve for x, and it's inside this uh, uh, term that is squared, so we want to eliminate the squared power, so we're going to take the square root of both sides. So when we take the square root of both sides, recognizing that we end up with a positive and a negative root. So we'll have x plus 7 halves is equal to the plus or minus the square root of 81 quarters. And of course, the square root of 81 quarters is 9 halves, so we have x plus 7 halves is equal to positive or negative 9 by 2. And now we're going to solve or isolate the x term by subtracting 7 halves from both sides of the equation, and we end up with x is equal to minus 7 halves plus or minus 9 by 2. This now gives us the two roots of that quadratic equation. So the two solutions are x is equal to a minus 7 halves plus 9 halves, and the other root is x is equal to minus 7 halves minus 9 halves. And of course, you can work those out yourselves.